how to program an Arduino Due using an Atmel IC programmer or S-Link V2 programmer and platform IO. Now before we start you need to know one thing. Uh, there's a bug and I don't know if it's a chip defect or it's the problem with platform IO or open OCD but if there is no code on the chip so you either get uh, a bare bone chip or you erase the memory uh, it won't run a program you load through JTAG or SWD and I know there is a mechanism that uh, the chip if it has no uh, program uh, that it should run a uh, USB bootloader but for some reason if you program it through JTAG or SWD it still thinks it's empty and it still runs the USB bootloader so first if you have any problems uh, with using the programmers you need to uh, load the sketch either through USB or UART so if you have this you can go on and connect your uh, IC programmer and now you need to uh, have a special script and I will show you in a second how it looks to program uh, the Due but I will just change the platformio.ini uh, config file and show that it works okay it's compiling programming and you can see that the frequency changed now the same works with the Esteling you have to believe me I plug it in the cable is very short and it should be connected like this and I will change the frequency again and change the uh, platform with that any file just to show you that it can upload it okay now it's compiling and as you can see the frequency changed so both ways work now let's see how it looks in a Visual Studio Code okay so if you programmed the Due through uh, UART before probably your uh, platformio.ini file looks something like this uh, now what you need to do to program it with Atmelize you will have to add these two lines now uh, this just says uh, we are using some custom script to uh, upload the sketch and this extra script is in this file and if we look in this file uh, there are, there is some code I will uh, leave a link below to this code so you can just uh, do something like this here um, new file script.py then you can just copy the the text and here uh, do script.py and it will work uh, I will leave it like this because I have two scripts to Atmelize and ST-Link and now for ST-Link uh, it's very similar you just uh, have a different file there's only a bit of difference if you can see uh, we change the interface here and uh, a different setting for the programmer but uh, yeah, that's all you just need uh, this file and it should be in the same folder as platformio.ini uh, uh, file and you will have to add these two lines interestingly there's another way to upload uh, the code using uh, Atmel ICE uh, you will still need some other program running on the board but uh, you don't have to uh, add the script uh, you, you can leave the platformio.ini file as it is uh, but you don't upload uh, here you go to run and you simply debug the board and for some reason the debugging works perfectly without any changes but to upload it you have to have the script file 
uh, it compiled now it's you can see it's starting to debug yeah and you can now iterate and step over all the functions so you can easily debug the board but if I just let it go it works or if you just reset the board it works fine so this is a way to to upload the code uh, if you don't want to play with all uh, the, the scripts and uh, changing the, the, the upload settings.